Riot have spoken out about the notorious 18,750 RP skins that got leaked, and they've actually come out and said that there's gonna be more to come. Stick around until the end, and I'll give you all the details. So this is a thread from Ken Adams, who is the product lead at Riot Games, and basically the main person who's speaking out about the Prestige skins. They wanted to address the fact that you can kind of tell what a Prestige skin is gonna look like once you've seen the base, and they wanted to make them kind of all stand out in their own way, I guess. So they said they wanted to experiment with more high fashion approaches to Prestige skins, and that they wanted to fuse their own own thematics with luxury fashion brand aesthetics. Funnily enough, the best prestige skins are actually the ones that are based off real life fashion, so stuff like True Damage, KDA skins, etc. Definitely looks like in the future the next couple of prestige 2.0 skins are going to be based off real life fashion. So to make the skins recognisable without the gold and white colour palette, they're going to make their own monogram. If you don't know what a monogram is, it's basically like a two or three letter logo, and they're going to find a way to intertwine that with the skin. To top it all off, they said we're taking something that's worked very well business wise for almost four years now and reinventing it to respond to player feedback. Each prestige this year is going to be pretty different than what you've seen before, and the goal is to make prestige more exciting and appealing without undermining its luxury appeal. Let me know what you guys think. Is the price more justified now, or is it still too expensive? And as always, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.